In this video, I want to show you all the amazing new marketing updates to Command. You're going to notice here in Sketch House, which will soon be renamed Designs, that when I click on the plus sign here, if I choose Social or Print, it's going to take me to all the new amazing templates. So we're going to do Social because that tends to be what I do the most. Create Template, and this is going to take you to our new library. These pieces are awesome. They look great. Our marketing division has been hard at work. and this isn't it. You're going to see even more keep coming into the system, so keep checking again and coming back. So you'll see here for for sale, and I've also got every one of these awesome layouts work out in Instagram format. So the square layout for Instagram, Instagram stories, which is a totally different layout as well, Twitter and LinkedIn. And it auto adjusts every one of those templates to fit the right size. So that's just awesome. I love it. You'll also see on the left, we could do just sold. We've got stuff for open houses, client testimonials, local expert. Be sure to come in here and play around and explore it. Now, the first thing I would do is actually go to add to library and fill in the information. Now, this should auto populate from what command has on you. Just make sure it's got the right information. This will help when you're adding text. You can add different text things like your tagline, your images. So you'll see I've already added my headshot, I've added a background, I've added different logos that I'm using, plus there's a logo section as well. And brand kit is where you choose your colors. I chose these colors off of the color palette for Keller Williams. So what's great about this is I can choose any one of these templates and start editing it. And you're going to notice this is very similar to what your Canva experience is. So once this editor opens, I'm able to change the color, flip out photos nice and easy, and I can do a lot of this and these designs in just a few seconds. So the neat thing here is it automatically went to my library. So I can flip out some of these logos. I'm actually going to change the color first. And you'll see I've got some colors already here. You can come to library colors. And these are already the KW colors. So if I wanted this to be red and change this to be white text, I could do that nice and easy. So template colors, let's do white over here, apply. I just did that in a few seconds. I can delete that logo, pop in this logo. Let's see where it needs to go. Here we go. And resize it. So I love how easy this is to use. I could put an address and edit the text here with all the same editing capabilities other systems have. Play around. It looks a little different than Canva, but it works just like it. So you'll just have to get used to the new layout. It's nice and easy to edit these things. All right, there we go. So I can say one, two, three, main street. Delete all that. It already has the each office independently open and operated. I can make this text larger. I said larger. <laughs> there we go. I can add my team logo to this. So if I want to put it over here in the corner, I can change out this photo really easily. So these are photos that I've added. I could also come to the company photos that we have some stock images for you. And if I want to change this out to something else, I could just flip, click, and drop. And if I need to recenter this, I double click, and then I can rearrange what section of the photo is being shown. So I love how easy this is. Once you're done, you can hit the save button, play around with each item. You can see you can add text. See, here's all the text I've added. Things for the company. I can also add icons, logos. This is just a nice and easy to use editor. I can also download this file into a JPEG, a PNG, which will have a clear background if I need it, and a PDF. Plus, you can share these on social media and different things. So I love the new designs. Take a look at this. Play around. Share with us what you've used. And once you're done, just simply hit save. Thanks for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, give it a like. Leave me a comment below. I'd love to hear from you. And as always, follow me on KB Connect today.